Yes, so much. Hello, guys. It's MM FIFA here, and we are doing the start of a new series on FIFA 15. It is not Ultimate Team. It is not Career Mode, but it's kind of a mix between them, and it's it's very complicated. Let me go through it. First of all, we go from the we go from the um, higher leagues from Division 12 or League 12 to League One. So, guys. And first of all, I'll show the squad, then we'll show you the league table, and now which different leagues there are, and then we'll jump into, and I'll tell you the rules, and we'll jump into the first ever game of this new series. So, first of all, our squad is basically, first of all, we have to start with, um, every single game we get an upgrade. For instance, we have to start with a team that is 64 and below, so I have done the best possible team I could do, the paciest team I could possibly do, under 64, 64 and under. So basically, in that, guys, you've got the probably one of the most well-rounded players in this game, uh, goalkeeping-wise. You've got this guy called um, Hartok, six foot three, very well-rounded for a bronze keeper, and yeah, he's just very well-rounded. and He'll be do doing good for us, six foot three, quite strong for a bronze keeper. So that's all I have to say about him. So next, we'll move on to Castillo. He is um, don't really call me a pace whore because he's 84. Pace 85, pace 6 foot 1. He isn't the strongest 70 strength, but his head actually isn't the best for a centre back. Is and he isn't that tall, and he's quite weak by the weight of him. So that really matter on us at a centre back, which is I know you guys are going to scream. He's a right back, yes, but I'm going to play him at centre back, which actually sounds pretty weird. But I want to. I want to play him at centre back, and because that's what his usual position is. Sorry about that. That's me just mucking up as usual. But next thing at right back, we have got Hector Bellerin. The Arsenal youngster, 91 pace average, that is. And, well, 91, 90.5, or um, 90.5 pace. 5 foot 10, looks the best. And next, left back, we have got another pace guy. He's Ghanaian. He has got 5 pace between the sprint speed and acceleration. He'll do a pretty good job at left back, 73 strength. Next, then we've got Manon, who's actually really pacey. And next, then we've got Hunt. And, for instance, if I got this guy, Rakasura, he is pretty quick, guys. And next thing, we've got Konokic, very quick as well. And, guys, the fastest game in the game, Bolly, OP, 6 foot 1. And next thing, we've got Aduro as well. So, we've got two strike. I don't know why you're playing Bolly at striker. He's a winger. But I want to play him at striker. It's my series. I can do what I want. But, basically, that's what we're going to do, guys. Next, now, let's jump into the leagues of this whole tournament. And basically show you what the leagues are of this whole tournament. So, the first ever league of this whole series, guys, is going to be the worst league, which is Republic of Ireland. You can understand why I chose them for the worst team, because they've got such a, such a bad league, in all fairness. No offense to the Irish people that like the league, but it is so bad, guys. So, net, first of all, guys, all I've got to do is, for instance, I randomized five times. For instance, if I randomize and it lands me on Dunkirk, and I would play them, and I'll play six times, but I wouldn't play the same team, guys. For instance, if I got Dunkirk again, and I'll oh, say the fourth time in the next fourth randomizer, I would have to randomize again and go for someone like Shamrock Rovers, or for instance, I randomize again and I get Sling on Rovers, or I get Shamrock Rovers and I go them instead. So basically, that's it. Well, the leagues 11th is Republic of Ireland. 11th, guys, which I think I have decided right now that 11th would be Australia in their league. And next league, guys, I think would be Saudi Arabia. And next we move on to, I think it was the Mexican league at 9. 8th, the Korean league. 7th, I would go with, um... I was going to go with, um... The USA League or the MLS. And at sixth, we're going to go with Belgian League. We actually pretty good guys. Seventh, we no fifth. We are going to go with um fifth. We're going to go with the Serie A, and next to that, we are going with um fifth. We're going with French League. Third, we're going with the German League, and second, we're going with Liga BVA. And to end it all off, guys, we have the BPL, except us, Everton, ourselves, actually, because it's a pretty strong team. So, guys, that's all the league's done. Let's explain the rules. If I score a goal, 
if I know basically if I win the game, I get an automatic upgrade. For instance, um, if I have Bowie there, no, if I have um, let's say Castillo, my centre back, and I want to upgrade him to someone, let's say this guy called Bolly, 82 pace or Bowley, 82 pace and six foot four, I would upgrade him because um, basically it has to be six, it has to be 65. Um, basically the max is um 64, six, 65. The 64 um, is how much we can upgrade to next. And if I upgrade again, I get to choose a player of my choice. Basically, guys, if I upgrade from silver, then to gold, which basically go into people like Ronaldo and all that kind of stuff. If I probably want Ronaldo early on in the series so he can help us make a strong team. But I'll be customizing this team every single game so you guys can see what happens and all that kind of stuff. Now, guys, it was just a quick series introduction. This series is going to be coming onto my channel very quickly. Very, very, very quickly. Um, I think it'll be in the next couple of days. This series will start coming on and it'll be uploaded as usual with the Chelsea career mode so we can have a fair balance of each of them. So, guys, thanks for watching this introduction. Ooh, I forgot to mention very quickly. If I win, if I get the title, for instance, if, if I win all six games... Basically, if I win all four, if I win four of the six games, I get to open a bronze pack. If I win five of the six games, I get to open a silver pack. And if I win six of the six games, then I win a gold pack. Now, with this, guys, I'm going to be opening it on Footwiz. If you know what that is, guys, I basically there's a silver, there's a bronze, and there's a gold pack. I really like the gold pack, so. That's really what I want to do, guys. But I could change it about. There could be a lot of, um, you know, different variations of other pack opening things that you want me to do. So, um, I'm probably going to stick with Footwiz at this now. If I get four, if I win four of the six games in the series, I get a bronze pack. If I win five of the games in the series uh, or a season, I win a silver pack. And if I win all games in the series, I get a gold pack. Which, guys, I think when I go into the English League, I will open a gold pack. For every single game, when we get to have these players in our club, I get to choose one of the players I want in the pack that I want. If it's an informed guys, we won't have to use it because or a team of the season or anything like that I won't use them. But if a Messi pops up in the pack, guys, in a, a if we win the title and we have like a I know half silver team, half um bronze team, and we get Messi in the pack, he can instantly go with the team. Doesn't matter if we have to upgrade guys, he could instantly go in the team. If you know what I'm talking about and all that kind of stuff. So, that's just been an introduction to the start of this series. <laughs> um, this has been an introduction to the start of the series. Thank you for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.